All right, um, looks like we'll be starting this predictions video with snow, but, uh, ladies and gentlemen, as always, your host, EG Flames, here bringing you, ladies and gentlemen, my NXT TakeOver War Games prediction number two. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's get right into the card, but before we do, I just gotta say, this is going to be a a great war games last year topped it but let's see if this year will be better so let's just get right into the card this is a very short card because it is only nxt so let's get right into the card the first match on this card it is johnny gargano versus alistair black now we do not know officially. I think Johnny Gargano's a heel. He said he's going to be the he's the good guy in the end of this rivalry. He said sometimes you're going to have to do some cheap things, like in in wrestling. And you know, I don't like this new character of Johnny Gargano. Honestly, I feel like he shouldn't have been the one attacking Alistair. I predicted that he was going to be the one, but I didn't think it was true because he was not appearing on NXT that much. So I was thinking maybe it is Gargano. I really wish it was someone else, but it's okay. But let's get right into the prediction. This rivalry is not going to end here, probably. It's probably going to continue and escalate. But um, I have a theory. I predict that Johnny Gargano is going to win this match by a cheap... Like, probably going to do a... Dis uh, the ref is knocked out, steel chair or low blow or something like that along those lines. And um, the, the match is over. But I do know for a fact that it has been rumored that Aleister Black is going to the main roster after Survivor Series. So, you know, I think it makes sense for Johnny Gargano to win because, uh, you know, Johnny Gargano gets rid of Aleister Black from NXT. Aleister goes to the main roster. You know, I would love to see that. So, um, my prediction is Johnny Gargano and... Um, Let's go into the next match. The next match, it is for the NXT Women's Championship. We got Shayna Baszler taking on Kyrie Sane in a two out of three falls match. Okay, um. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna do a very cheap prediction. This is gonna be a very cheap prediction. Um. Hmm. I think it's going to be Shayna Baszler with the win. Retaining the title because she literally just won the title. Also, she is definitely better women's champion than Kyrie Sane. I love the gimmick of her as a pirate like and stuff. But, you know, I feel like this win has to go to Shayna Baszler to, you know, represent the MMA. Just like Ronda Rousey's doing at Survivor Series. So I'm going to go with Shayna Baszler picking up the win, retaining the NXT Women's Championship. The next match, ladies and gentlemen, it is for the NXT Heavyweight Championship. We got Tommaso Ciampa defending his championship against the Velveteen Dream. I'm really excited for this match. I love the rivalry between these two guys. I think this is going to steal the show because, you know, we got the Velveteen Dream. Velveteen Dream. Like, I'm really excited for this, ladies and gentlemen. So, um, let's get to the prediction. Um, who can win this? Who can win this? Um, it's going to be a close call, but I'm going to say that Tommaso Ciampa retains the title. You know, I think he needs to have a long title reign. Maybe, maybe hold it until TakeOver New York, New, New York, New, New Jersey, like until WrestleMania time, he should hold that title. I just don't think this is the right time for him to lose the title going in to 2019. So uh, my prediction is for Tommaso Ciampa to retain the NXT Heavyweight Championship. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we get to the main event of the evening. It is a War Games match between the Undisputed Era, Bobby Fish, Kyle O'Reilly. Or no, that's not Kyle O'Reilly. Ugh. Between the Undisputed Era and the War Raiders, Ricochet and Pete Dunne. Ricochet, NXT, North American champion. Pete Dunne, NXT, UK champion. You know, this... Uh, a lot of championships are missing in this match. No wonder why we're not having it. Who do I think is going to win? 
I think the Undisputed Era has to win this because, you know, they won last year. I think it would make sense for them to win again. Also, I think P. Don, Ricochet, and the War Raiders are going to do a mishap or something like that. Because, you know, um, something always happens with the face arguing, with the faces arguing. So I'm going to go with the Undisputed Era winning this match and just bas basically just going, Adam Cole, baby! Like, you know, all that stuff. So I, I'm predicting that the Undisputed Era will beat Ricochet, Pete Dunn, and the War Raiders. So, ladies and gentlemen, those are my predictions for NXT TakeOver War Games 2. Because this is the second time we're doing it. And I'm really excited for the pay-per-view in general. But I think they could do better. I love the fact that they're doing the War Games match again. But I do not think having the UK title and the North American title not on the line. And the tag team titles on the line does not make sense. So, it is what it is. But, um... Yeah, I really think that it should have been Ricochet versus um, Adam Cole at this pay-per-view. But it's okay. Ladies, you know, the, those were my predictions for NXT TakeOver War Games number 2. If you enjoyed, please make sure to smash the like on this video. Subscribe. Follow me on my social medias down in the description. Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. Follow me on Twitch. It's been your host, EG Flames, with the predictions of NXT TakeOver War Games. And he is out. Boom!